time in the history of this freaking show, we are going to do a segment called Jiggy to Jigga. Because yeah. we have Jigga Jones in the building. Yeah, man, what's going on? <laughs> what in the world? I seen you across the room over there. Oh, yeah, they call me Jigga Jones. I'm the number one nigga in the world. <laughs> Yes! Yeah, man. So, you know, I used to be Jigga Boo Jones, but they stopped me from saying that because Boo scares me. <laughs> so, and now it's just Jigga Jones. You know, what is so funny is when Trump started going after that lady in New York, and he kept calling her Peekaboo, and everybody's, it took people two months, and they're like, I think it's racist. And I'm like, do you not know what he's trying to say? I don't know what he was trying to say. <laughs> but yeah, it was all right, you know. You know, uh, hopefully we can get to a point where people can get back to laughing and everything. I'll know? tell you. Because everybody's like, oh, I'm offended. That's, that's what's in style now. People have, people I'm will offended. go through gymnastics <laughs> mentally to be offended at something. Yeah. You know, they get offended, they weren't even there. You know, you know what I think is great is we talk about all sorts of crazy stuff on this show. We go to the strip clubs, we go, we, 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 we do it all. It's, it, it's fantastic. And I love the fact that you've got your whole setup here. Oh, yeah. Tell me, I always do this with the webcam girls. Tell me about your outfit. Man, I got this from the Delamo <laughs> Swap Me. And, uh, you know, I had my boy with the silk screen on the thing here. Put the chicken okay. on there. Chicken Jones. You know, it, you can only find quality shit like this at the Swap Me. You won't find none of this, you know, in, in those places where you pay a whole lot of money. This, was, this whole suit was like 20 bucks. You know, awesome. and it would have been free if if I, if I could have ran out of the place. But you know, I wasn't feeling about top. I didn't have my track shoes on. So no track shoes, you know, yeah. that's what you got to do. You know, sometimes oh, you got to pay for something. You know, in California now it's legal to steal shit. I could I could have gone back and done that, but you know, <laughs> California, yeah. yeah, it is. You know, it's nine hundred dollars. Up to nine hundred dollars. Okay. Yeah, man. I'm heading to California next vacation. Hey, just don't stay there. You know, <laughs> I'll show people how to how to get our hotel rooms. You know. And that was fun too back in the day before they had all these cards. Yes. You know what you do is you go to a hotel and you uh, you make a copy of the key. Yes. Like a, like a Home Depot, so like make a copy of the key. And when you see the people leave, you go in there and pop that. And we were doing the rental cars too. Rental cars are fun because everybody puts the valuables in the trunk. You take that little GPS thing and put it in the trunk of the car. You know, and then you make copies of keys. You know, on Saturday you just drive around with your laptop and find find a car. You know, bust the trunk open and people like, I, I thought I put a laptop in there. Where did it go? You know, I thought it was in the trunk. You know, where did you think it was left in the hotel room? You know, so, so yeah, you know, stealing now is, is, is like legal in California. I had fun. So now now it's no fun. Now. What's the fun in stealing something that's legal? That's right. That's right. Many like you like Congress or the Senate or something like that are stealing like that. You know, that what's shit. the fun of that? You know? Of that. What's funny is uh, I do like a. Uh, what's so funny is about you, your whole your whole gimmick here. Yeah. I do a loose. I've done a loose impression the entire week. I have another character. Oh, and really? I dress up in a banana costume. Uh -oh. and I have a giant afro. Mm -hmm. And I was been trying to figure out what voice am I doing. And when you talk, it sounds like you. Oh, that's I'm good. doing a loose impression. Oh, that's good. Of Jiggy Jones yeah. in a banana costume. You, you should have had like a fried chicken leg, you know, with an afro on top. That would be the black people would come to it. You know, oh, bananas God. and monkeys are gonna come around. You know, and, and, the, and the vegans and stuff. The and vegans they're not as fun. Yeah, they're not as yeah. fun. So, so Brittany cannot. Brittany, our camera person, she cannot stand my outfit. She hates. It. Why, because it's green? I don't know. The green is cool. Green is cool. You gotta get a green hat to go with it. You know? That's right. And the pointy shoes, you gotta have that. You know, you gotta have that. You gotta have the little pointy shoes, you know, in case of the cockroach in the corner kicking bow, you know. <laughs> you gotta have that. You, know, you, you are the fan, sir. Yeah, I'm man. telling you what. The Jiggy Jaguar, I like that. But so we would like to make a symbol like J2 for two J's, right? That's right. Yeah. See, I, I've also got a, a giant sombrero that I wear. Oh, wow. Around. She won't let me leave the hotel. Oh, no. She's like, I'm not leaving. You put nachos in the thing and the top of it. What I used to do is I would go walk around at these festivals, and I would always, I had this joke that I said, which was insane. I don't understand why it was funny back in the day, but I used to just howl like a little girl. I would be like, I got the Mexican hat, because I was called the Mexican and I and I, <laughs> and I and I would put a bottle of water in it to be like, ah, the Mexican hat, and it holds water. And then I would tap it like a little girl. Hmm. I've watched old episodes of Jiggy Jake TV. I'm like, why was that funny? Well, you know, you gotta be able to laugh at everything. You know? 
when people say that they offended with something, find out, find out what's wrong with that person who has that. You know, you, you, you find out, I'm offended with this. Why? Why? Were you there? You know, why were you there? What, what, what happened? Why wasn't there? But I saw it. Oh, my God. Put your pearls out of my neck. You know? That's so right. You look at people like that and say, you know what? You can just this down. Oh, you know? So, yeah, you wear a big old suburban hat. You got to do it. You got know? to gotta have a taco in your hand. That's right. It meant that I had to be Tuesday. That's right. That's what I was saying. You know what's funny is we went to Del Taco on Taco Tuesday and we didn't take advantage of the special. What? Okay. <laughs> so strange. You know, what's good about Del Taco, they do have a good burger over there, too. Just in case you don't like Taco. Brittany had the burger. Oh, no, I didn't. I had nachos. She had nachos. Nachos, okay. But they weren't yours then. She had them. <laughs> <laughs> so I, am, I cannot wait for the next interview. We are going to have Jigga Jones interview with Big Will because you say yo Jigga Jones the number one nigga in America. Yeah. So what the hell makes Big Will? Is he two, three? I don't know what he's he Does he, he steal cars? Uh, no, but he's he he's got a fashion sense like no other. Oh, he sure do. And those shades are stunning, boy. That's that's for real. They go home and five real. You know? <laughs> <laughs> this guy is in high definition 4K all the time. All right. Cool, man. <laughs> it's good to see you out here, Dave. Oh, man. you're the man. We'll be here next year. Oh, we're, we're here well, every I year. I will follow you again. <laughs> Jiggy Jones, the man, the myth, the legend. He is He is just, I don't even know what to say. I don't even have any metaphors this morning. I am Jiggy Jones. I mean, he's like, I'll hide this video. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for watching Jiggy Jones TV.